ideal gas law. P1, V1 over T1 equals P2, V2 over T2. It's a sealed container. What does that mean? Okay. Generally, it means volume is constant. Okay, if you have a sealed aluminum box, do you expect that box to randomly get bigger or smaller? No, that would be weird, right? So uh, from this, I can see 2 is going to equal uh, P1 times T2 over T1. So that gives me um, 5 times 10 to the 4th newtons per square meter, again, which is the same as a Pascal, so that's weird. Um, and then Kelvin over 200 Kelvin. And 250 over 200 is 1.25, so this comes out to be like 6, no, 25, what's 0.25 of this? 6.25? Was it? Huh? Yeah. Um, so I think it's like 6.25 times 10 to the fourth newtons per square meter. Do we get that as our pressure, our new pressure? Okay. And then, of course, what do you need to do in part B to make this work? Yeah. You cannot do ratios with Celsius. Why? True. You have to have in Kelvins. Why? water freeze at? Zero in Celsius. Why zero? No. Do you see? That's why you cannot use Celsius ever when you're doing these fractions. If you'll notice this problem right here, when your, when your constant, when your value for specific heat has a degree Celsius in it, now you can use Celsius. But when you are using the ideal gas law and you're making a ratio of temperatures, you have to use Kelvin because Celsius can be zero. Can Kelvin ever be zero? No, it won't ever get to zero. Right? That's why we can do that. So um, then we just have, so T1 is going to be 473 Kelvin. T2 is going to be 523 Kelvin. So now you can do that. So P2 will once again equal P1 times 523 over 473. And now our change is like 10%. So it's going to be 5 or 5.6 or something like that. Do it out on your crepulator. Tell me what it is. So what's 5 times 523 over 473? Anyone? Anyone? Bueller? Uh, I love that one. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Good gravy. 5.5 .5 times 10 to the 4th <laughs> newtons per square meter. So the answer, why can't you just divide 200 by 250 for part B? Because it's not in Kelvin. You cannot use Celsius when you have a ratio.